right, you goofy looking goobers. We got the Toe Ants and Art uh, body kit, upgrade kit, whatever you want to call it, for Majin Buu, Super Majin Buu. Here's the back of the box. We're gonna just check it out, just get a few pictures in. This is gonna be a shorter video. Hopefully I don't take too long on it. Um, we are going to be adding it to our here we go with our super majin boo and uh yeah let's just get right into it baby all right so let's crack it open yeah I like that huh all right so basically as you can see this is everything that it comes with you got two open hands two of these like uh i don't even know what you, what you even call these hands fight poser hands Got the long banana on the head. We got the, I want to say that's a Makanko Sapo Special Beam Cannon. Two fists and two open hands. They're a lot thinner than the other hands on the figure. And here are the faces. We got the grinny face. We got the yelling face. The red eyes look really good. And then we got the smirking haha -ha face. And then we got the vest, of course. Let's go ahead and get our figure and then we'll start putting it all together. So really quick before I begin, I wanted to show you two hands side by side, one from the original Super Boo, and then one from the uh, my, the upgrade kit. Sorry, my hands are a little ashy, I'll lotion them up right now. This is the OG, as you can tell, it looks a lot thicker, a lot more gelatin-like, and then this one's more refined. You can even see the detail in the fingers right there, the little crease. Oh, it's a, overall a lot more detail in uh, the toe and art. Yeah, let's let's get to this actual. All right, so here is our blank canvas, technically, and let's go ahead and assemble our um, Majin Buu. So first, we got the head. I'm gonna go ahead and use the grinning face. We're just gonna make it vanilla right now. Get the long back, plug it right into the back. This comes off, but you know, don't fret. Can't pop it right back on. I accidentally squeezed it too hard in my hand when I was doing that. So it is articulated right here. Can rotate upward, which is kind of crazy goes downward and then this also rotates right here so let's go ahead and pop it on and one thing i noticed is that at least on mine the head doesn't go on 100 percent all the way so it will pop off pretty easily but you know you're not meant to play with these so remember use at your own just by your own discretion but remember the things i tell you then let's go ahead and add the hands we're going to use the fist hands just to make it easy on us pop right on they don't really look too much different from the regular hands, except they're a little more lean, more muscular hands, whatever that means. And then finish off with the vest. Let's go ahead and pop the arms back. I like to just put the arms back preemptively. Let's take this off, yeah. Preemptively break the arms, one in there. Get this, oh wait, this is actually kind of difficult. Maybe go like this? How did I get this on before? I don't even remember. I've already put this on, so it's weird that I can't. Maybe if we just, no hold on all right so after toiling with it for a few seconds i the, the arms up is the best way to go about it and be careful because the paint does split but once it's on there it looks very good let's go ahead and put the head on there finish him up and badow now this looks really sick i'm not even gonna lie to you this figure on its own, like, was already probably one of my top five SH figure arts of all time. But now, with this upgrade kit, like, damn. I just really hope that they, I really hope that they continue to do this. Like, they could do stuff from the Budokai series with the Frieza and the um, Cell version where he absorbs them in the game. He could even do the Piccolo where he's got the cape. You know what I mean? They could do all that good stuff right here. Um... Really not much to say. I'm just going to go ahead and tell you that, yeah, I think you should go out and buy this if you can. I think I paid 55 for mine. I bought it online on Macari. Probably won't get it from too much more than that right now, at least, unless you're going to pre-order it again. I don't really remember the retail. I'll try to put it down here if I remember it um, or if I can look it up and you know, in time. But yeah, go out and get this if you can. This is fire. Short video today. How I'm going to end it off right now is I'm just going to get a series of, you know, photos with him, maybe some other figures, and just kind of let the the kit speak for itself. So, I've been in Nintendo. I'll see you all on the next one. Remember to like. Remember to comment if you uh, want to say anything. Tell me I'm autistic. Or I'm autistic.